Have you ever heard about the Kiko goat breed? Today we'll dive deep into this fascinating breed's world. The Kiko goat is a breed that's been gaining popularity among farmers and breeders alike, and for good reasons. Originating from New Zealand, these goats are known for their resilience, high productivity and minimal care requirements, making them a real game changer in the farming scene. They're not just any ordinary goats. Kikos bring unique qualities to the table which we will delve into in this video. If you've had any experience with Kiko goats or perhaps you've heard some intriguing stories about them, we would love to hear them. So if you're curious about the Kiko goat breed, stick with us, we're about to embark on an exciting journey of discovery. And don't forget to like and subscribe to Farming Know How for more amazing farming content. So where did the Kiko goat breed originate? Our journey takes us back to the beautiful landscapes of New Zealand. It was the late 70s when a need arose to develop a breed of goat that could thrive in the country's challenging and diverse terrains. The mission was simple yet ambitious, to create a breed that was hardy, adaptable, and required minimal assistance for survival and reproduction. Enter Garrick and Ann Batten, two forward-thinking goat farmers from the northern part of the South Island. They undertook an extensive selection process, combining the best of feral goats with imported dairy breeds. The result was a breed that truly lived up to the goals set for its creation. Now you might be wondering about the name, Kiko. It's not just a cool sounding term, but a word steeped in meaning. In the Maori language, native to New Zealand, Kiko translates to flesh or meat. The name was chosen to underline the breed's primary purpose, meat production. It was a clear signal to farmers that this breed was a cut above the rest when it came to meat yield. The Kiko goat breed quickly gained recognition for its exceptional qualities. It was found to be resistant to many of the diseases common to other breeds and showed remarkable resilience in the face of harsh weather and tough grazing conditions. The Kiko goat breed was not just surviving in these conditions, it was flourishing. And so, the breed spread from the verdant pastures of New Zealand to farms across the globe. Today, Kiko goats are found in many parts of the world, from the rolling hills of North America to the vast landscapes of Australia, continuing to impress with their hardiness and high productivity. So, that's how the Kiko goat breed came into being, a true testament to the ingeniousness of farming practices. Now that we know where the Kiko goat breed comes from, what makes it unique? Well, one of the first things you'll notice about the Kiko goat is its size. Males also known as bucks can weigh anywhere from 200 to 300 pounds, while females or does typically weigh between 150 to 200 pounds. This is a significant weight range, making Kikos one of the larger goat breeds out there. And it's not just their size that's impressive. Kiko goats are also known for their robustness and hardiness. They are incredibly adaptable creatures able to thrive in a variety of climates and terrains. Whether it's the scorching heat of summer or the bone-chilling cold of winter, Kikos prove their resilience time and again. This adaptability extends to their diet as well. Kikos are excellent foragers capable of finding sufficient nutrition even in sparse landscapes. This makes them a low-maintenance breed ideal for farmers who prefer to let their livestock roam freely, grazing on whatever vegetation is available. Now let's talk about color. Kikos come in a variety of colors from pure white to black and every shade in between. Some are even multicolored, sporting patches of different hues on their coats. This color variation adds a unique aesthetic appeal to the breed, making them a sight to behold in any farmyard. Behaviorally speaking, Kikos are known to be docile and calm. They're not as playful or mischievous as some other goat breeds, which can be a blessing for farmers who don't want to constantly keep an eye on their livestock. Despite their calm demeanor, they're also known to be fiercely protective mothers, ensuring the survival of their offspring. All these factors, their size, adaptability, color variations, and calm demeanor, make the Kiko goat breed quite unique. Whether you're a seasoned farmer or a newcomer to the world of livestock, considering the inclusion of Kiko goats in your herd can be a wise decision indeed. These characteristics make the Kiko goat breed a favorite among farmers and livestock enthusiasts alike. But what are the benefits of raising Kiko goats you might ask? Well, Kiko goats bring a multitude of advantages to the table that make them a top choice for farmers and livestock enthusiasts alike. Let's start with their hardiness. Kiko goats are renowned for their robust health and resilience. They're not ones to be easily knocked down by illness or harsh weather. Originating from the rugged landscapes of New Zealand, these goats have evolved to thrive in even the harshest of conditions. This resilience translates to fewer veterinary bills and less time spent on health management, 
a boon for any farmer. Now let's talk about productivity. These goats are excellent foragers, with an ability to convert a wide range of vegetation into high-quality meat. They can be relied upon to maintain their body condition, and continue producing even when the going gets tough. Kiko goats are also known for their high fertility rates and excellent mothering skills which means more kids per doe and less intervention needed during kidding season. But it's not just about hardiness and productivity. Kiko goats are also low maintenance making them a dream for farmers. They have strong feet that rarely need trimming and are less susceptible to parasites compared to other breeds. This means less time and money spent on routine care and more time focusing on other aspects of your farm. So, what does all this mean for a farmer? Simply put, Kiko goats can lead to increased profitability. Lower vet bills, less maintenance and high productivity all contribute to a healthier bottom line. It's a simple equation. Less input and more output equals more profit. But it's not all about the money. Raising Kiko goats can also be incredibly rewarding. Their friendly nature and unique characteristics make them a joy to work with and a favorite among farmers. So you see the Kiko goat breed isn't just unique, it's a valuable addition to any farm. With their hardiness, productivity and low maintenance needs, Kiko goats are more than just livestock. They are a smart investment and a testament to the beauty of nature's adaptability. So, how do Kiko goats fit into modern farming practices? Well, let's dive into that. Kiko goats are a major player in the contemporary agricultural scene, and it's not difficult to understand why. Their inherent characteristics and advantages make them a perfect fit for modern farming values which prioritize sustainability, productivity, and effective land management. When we talk about sustainable farming, Kiko goats are a textbook example. These hardy animals require minimal intervention making them a low-input breed. This means less reliance on veterinary services, less expenditure on supplemental feed, and overall, a smaller carbon footprint. It's a win-win situation for both the farmer and our planet. Moving on to the realm of meat production, Kiko goats are a real game-changer. Their rapid growth rate and exceptional meat-to-bone ratio make them an efficient and profitable choice for farmers. These goats have a knack for converting feed into muscle, which means more meat on your plate and more money in your pocket. And let's not forget, the meat of Kiko goats is lean and flavorful, making it a favorite among health-conscious consumers. But the role of Kiko goats in modern farming doesn't stop at meat production. These goats are also excellent at land management. Their voracious appetite for a wide variety of plants, including many that are considered weeds, makes them natural weed controllers. This reduces the need for harmful chemical herbicides, contributing to a healthier and more biodiverse farm ecosystem. Furthermore, their ability to thrive in harsh conditions and rough terrains helps in soil conservation. By grazing these areas, Kiko goats prevent soil erosion and promote the growth of native plant species. So, when you look at the bigger picture, you'll see that Kiko goats are not just another breed. They are a sustainable, profitable, and eco-friendly solution to many of the challenges faced by modern farming. Clearly, the Kiko goat breed plays a significant role in modern farming, contributing to sustainable and profitable operations. We've covered a lot about the Kiko goat breed today. We've journeyed from the roots of this resilient breed in New Zealand, to its unique characteristics that make it a farmer's favorite. We've highlighted its hardiness, adaptability, and excellent maternal instincts, not to mention its benefits, such as high meat yield and low maintenance needs. In the world of modern farming, the Kiko goat stands tall, contributing significantly to sustainable and profitable farming practices. Its ability to thrive in diverse climates and conditions makes it a versatile asset on the farm. It's clear that the Kiko goat is not just a breed, it's a revolution in the farming industry. But remember, every farming journey is unique, and what works for one may not work for another. So, take your time, do your research, and see if the Kiko goat is the right fit for your farm. We hope you found this information about the Kiko goat breed useful. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and share with your friends. Stay tuned to Farming Know-How for more exciting farming content.